welcome to today's episode of the Sleep Like a Boss podcast. I'm Anika Carroll, the new CEO of Sleep Like a Boss, the network of sleep experts, and I'm excited that you're here today. Um, thank you for being here. You might be new to the show, or you might have been following Sleep Like a Boss with Christine Hansen for a while. Um, thank you for being here. And I want to use this opportunity today to talk to you about um, what's it like to work with us. Either if you knew or you've been around for a while, you might have considered reaching out, but for some reason you still haven't. And I was going to just talk to you a little bit about how we work so you can maybe get a bit of a glimpse and an idea of what it is like to be a client at Sleep Like a Boss. So what we do with our clients, um, once you've decided that we're a good fit, we do a very extensive intake with you. So we sit together with you for, it can be an hour, it can be an hour and a half. Um, this is all online. Um, and we go through your health history, a very detailed health history to see where are you at currently? What are your sleep issues like? And are there any under other underlying things that might be of importance to us that we need to consider um, when working with you? And um, then we're going to start looking with you um, into points like, what, what's your day like? What do 24 hours look like? Uh, when do you get up? What do you do then? How do you structure your day? Um, how do you prepare yourself for bed at night? When do you eat? What do you eat? Um, those kinds of things are things we start off with to see um, where you're at and how we can improve and those things are ready because sometimes optimizing the basics can already get our clients to feel a lot better and sleep a lot better. Um, and then once we've gotten the test results back that we're going to run with you, we're going to look through those and we're going to come up with protocols that support you in healing whatever your body might be going through at that point. And um, maybe I'll quickly give you a, a brief introduction on the test that we run. We do run a gut test, a stool test, to see if there's any imbalances in your gut. That means more potentially more bad bacteria than good bacteria. If we have any parasites, which is quite common, or we have candida, which is a yeast overgrowth, because all these things have a really, really big impact on your sleep. Then um, we will also run a thyroid test because depending on if your thyroid is overactive or underactive, that can have impacts on your sleep. We do run a food sensitivity test that will also give us an idea on how to maybe tweak your nutrition a little for a while to see if there are foods that trigger your system and that cause inflammation in the system and that would then let cortisol rise and, and not let you sleep. We also look at a Dutch test. We run a test that Dutch is an abbreviation for dried urine test for comprehensive hormones. So we look at your cortisol pattern throughout the day and the night. We look at your testosterone, your estrogens, your progesterone to see if not just with your cortisol and your melatonin, but maybe also with your sex hormones, there's something that could be out of balance because that could also cause insomnia specifically on estrogen and progesterone um, if they're low. And we will also run what is called a hair tissue mineral analysis, which is a test that a lot of people are not familiar with. So we do take a little bit, bit of your hair from underneath on the back. You do that at home and then um, send it into the lab. And then um, it gets analyzed for, are there currently any heavy metals that are... Um, disposed into your hair or excreted into your hair that need to be looked at. Do you have mineral deficiencies? And we do see that quite frequently with people that we have um, potassium, sodium, calcium, magnesium, not in balance. And that can definitely cause sleep issues. And that can also sometimes explain why when people start supplementing with magnesium, their sleep might still not be improving. So those are the tests that we will send to your home and you get guidance from us on how to run them 
And then you, they get picked up from your home to go to the lab. And then once we get the results, we work with you through those results, explain everything, because I think education is key that you understand what's going on in your body. And if you then go to a doctor at some point and discuss things, you also have that as your backbone and you can, you've understood it and then you can use it for your benefit. Um, the other thing that we definitely are going to do is look at your resiliency and your stress management and teach you techniques on how you can optimize your day and um, your night to just get a better sleep by calming your system. Um, and one thing that I want to mention that I think is I think it's key to success um, and is why our clients are so successful in working with us is that we are there for our clients every day, Monday through Friday during our business hours. So if you work with me, you get my phone number and through Voxer or WhatsApp, you can get a hold of me and we can discuss things in real time. So, um, and that might be something that right now you're like, oh yeah, that's great. But I don't really see the... I don't even know if I really need that or can I really reach out? Yes, you absolutely can. I'm working with a client right now and she in the beginning was a little hesitant and she was saying, oh, I'm sorry, like I'm reaching out so much. No, that's absolutely what I'm there for. And that is so important. You're going through a lot of changes in the program and I think we're suggesting lots of things to be done and to be tried out for you and um, it's important to have somebody to reach out to who can say, yeah, this is okay. If you're reacting this way, that's fine. Keep going. You're doing great. Um, somebody to cheer you on, somebody to be accountable to. So when the change is sometimes not so easy because our brain doesn't really like change, right? And wants us to protect, wants to protect us from it, that we're there to guide you through and get you to those successes. And I've personally worked with a ton of practitioners in the past to get through my sleep issues, my burnout, my anxiety attacks. And um, basically most of my practitioners work that way that it was an appointment by appointment basis. And they would, I would go there, we would talk everything through, through. it was all kind of clear to me in that moment, I left, I got, for instance, my supplements, I went home, I was like, oh, how am I supposed to do this again? Hmm, okay, yeah, twice a day, okay, with meal, okay, I'll do that, and then I started taking supplements, and I started to get some sort of reaction, maybe my gut was a little upset, or, um, I just had energy in the evening, which I didn't want, or some other thing, and I try to reach out to the practitioners and would be like, can I have a talk to this person? In that case, it was a naturopath. And they were like, yeah, yeah, she's going to call you back over lunch tomorrow. And then that didn't happen because some other appointments ran over. And then I had to chase them. And in a lot of cases, it always happened that, that I had to wait to the next appointment. And what did that lead to? That led to the fact that I actually didn't take the supplements because I was concerned about the side effects and I didn't understand them, even though they were in those cases harmless and I, I could have just backed down and, and scaled back up but nobody told me that and it just really led to the fact that I delayed the whole process to the next appointment I didn't follow the protocol and I didn't see the success um, and that is why I think the the fact that we do a one-on-one -on -one coaching with people and that we are there for you along the way all the time is so important and it's so key to success um, and uh, if you're somebody who's, who's thinking about getting help with sleep, um, don't hesitate to reach out to us. And we do free assessment calls with anybody who is interested in the program to make sure that you're the right fit, that we can actually help you. And if we have the impression that we can't, we will tell you that. But if we feel that we do, then we'll happily um, support you. But it's very important, I think, to uh, to find the right practitioner that who you trust and who you can work with. Um, and then um, I think one one important point from my own experience going through a PTSD, burnout, anxiety, sleep issues, all that kind of stuff. The longer you wait, the harder it is to fix it. Because the one thing is that the body just um, 
I don't want to say the word deteriorates, but the body just like this, the systems just get out of balance even more. And we kind of manifest a lot of these things in our mind also more. So to unravel everything is just going to um, take a little longer, the longer you wait. So I would always encourage people to just reach out and see if that's something that you're interested in and then um, talk to us about it. Um, yeah, so I really invite you to do that. If you have any questions about this, um, any more things that you do. Yeah, we all work internationally. We, we kind of try to stick to time zones that work for you best and us best. Um, we all work internationally. We can ship our tests anywhere. And then we all do this online. And if you want email exchange or we do the Voxer and, and WhatsApp support. And um, yeah, I think it works really, really well. And um, if you have any questions on this, please, please reach out to us. Um, you can reply to the email that you got with the newsletter. You can just go to our website at cblackaboss.com. There's a contact form there, or you can send me an email. It's Annika, so A-N-N-I-K-A at sleeplikeaboss.com. And we'd love to hear from you. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And I hope you're going to have a good night's sleep tonight. Bye.